Some war gases are spread as liquids, which slowly evaporate, giving off invisible but poisonous vapor. This type of gas remains for a long time, and hence is called persistence. Certain chemicals neutralize this liquid gas and trained decontamination teams of the United States Citizens Defense Corps, which is the civilian protection force of your community, are equipped to neutralize the liquid gas so that people may go outside without danger of exposure to the liquid or its poisonous fumes. But these workers must wear special gas-proof clothing and masks for protection. The completeness of their protective clothing emphasizes the fact that without such special protection, you must stay indoors until notified that the liquid gas has been neutralized and that the air is free of harmful gas fumes. Liquid gas may also be washed away by a heavy rain or by a stream of water from a fire hose. Out in the fields where liquid gas has been dropped, dry chemicals that neutralize the liquid gas are mixed with the earth. This scene should remind us to stay off the grass after a gas attack. Persistent liquid gas and the fumes that it gives off may be lurking unseen and covered by grass or shrubbery for days or even weeks after it has dropped there.